When I hear the word creativity, what I think of is just being unique and creating your own ideas. Hello, my name is Tyson Tensno, and I'm a player for Sentinels. Hello, I'm Rosie, and I've created a piece of virtual reality artwork inspired by the professional Valorant esports player, Tens. I think something that makes me a unique player is I'm always coming up with new ideas and I'm very creative with how I use pieces of utility. I know that there's a lot of different mechanics in the game that I can kind of abuse or twist. I just try to play really annoying and kind of be really disruptive. I was just really enjoying researching Tens and watching his videos. They're just really, it's really entertaining. I just felt like I got to know him. And then when I entered the virtual space, it became just like I was bringing to life his YouTube character. And it just felt like I was getting to know him even more. When I think of art, I think of it as something that someone created, whether it be maybe like an actual canvas or it can be more of like a, a theoretical canvas. So it could be really anything. So in my illustration, especially on the, the poses with Jet. I really wanted to get across how he's such a creative, strategic player. I thought the best approach for this, given that Tens loves anime, was to make like a manga comic um, style story to show this relatable person, not just this talented esports player. He's actually just a really nice guy. That, along with the manga style, just goes really well in creating this, this story of Tens embodying the game and really becoming this all-seeing, all-encompassing, powerful Valorant champion. The first time I found out I was colorblind was actually somewhere in grade school. Really, I'm not too sure how I perceive colors because it's kind of like an abstract idea where you don't really know what colors is, you don't know how to explain colors. At the end, that final frame, just being him bursting into colour out of this black and white manga in this sort of magic way to sort of show that he's got this really bright future ahead, which he really does. 